The ceremonial opening of the 2017 legal year was held at City Hall. Chief Justice Jeffrey Ma inspected the ceremonial guard mounted by the Hong Kong police. Secretary for Justice Rimsky Yoon said community discussion on public affairs has become polarised and politicised, and every effort should be made to prevent this trend from eroding the foundation of the rule of law. He said the National People's Congress Standing Committee interpretation of Basic Law Article 104 will not harm the rule of law. On 7th of November 2016, the Standing Committee of the National People's Congress, the NPCSC, in exercise of its power under Article 158 of the Basic Law, pronounced an interpretation of Article 104 of the Basic Law, which concerns the constitutional duty on the part of certain specified categories of public officials when assuming office to swear to uphold the Basic Law and to swear allegiance to the Hong Kong SAR of the People's Republic of China. The making of the interpretation has attracted much attention both locally and internationally. On my part, I am confident that the rule of law in Hong Kong does and will remain well and alive after the interpretation. The way in which our judges professionally handled the relevant legal proceedings during and subsequent to the making of the interpretation proves my point beyond doubt. Chief Justice Ma said courts and judges are not immune to criticism and he accepts the right of people to comment on the court's work. However, these views should be informed and measured. Over the past year or so, I've sometimes received complaints from members of the public criticising the courts for the way they've dealt with certain cases. Dissatisfaction is expressed in the courts either not convicting persons of crimes or even if there were convictions, in imposing what are seen to be light, inadequate punishments. Correspondingly, dissatisfaction is also expressed when the courts have convicted or imposed what are seen to be heavy punishments. Whatever motivated these criticisms or comments, it is crucial to bear in mind the approach of the courts. In highly charged or high-profile cases, all parties are treated in exactly the same way by the courts as in any other type of case.